next artificial attractive acquired immunity so these in this the defense or resistance in individual developed by the inoculation of inoculation inoculation of weak and antigens in the body antigens in the body so how to uh, inoculation of weakened antigens in the body means here so giving the vaccinations to our body giving the vaccination to our body right so suppose example for example the tetanus tetanus taxin so which is given to the uh, tt per affected persons so then it uh, affects to the against it responds or it responds to the produce the immune response against to the tetanus disease suppose if we are giving the injection of tetanus taxin so that is response to produce the immune response against to the tetanus taxis taxins of pathogens okay so next uh, passive acquired immunity so next topic is passive acquired immunity passive acquired immunity so in this the defense or resistance of any individuals are developed by the ready made ready made antibodies in the body antibodies in the body so right ready made antibodies in the body suppose uh, if the uh, persons if we know about the passive acquired immunity so here the defense or resistance uh, of any individual obtained by the prepared or ready made antibodies in the body so suppose uh, these passive acquired uh, immunity is again split into two types first one is active sorry natural natural passive acquired immunity acquired immunity so natural passive acquired immunity so in this persons the defense or uh, any resistance obtained from the transform transformation of transformation of antibodies antibodies from the parents to the child from the parents to the child so the antibody here the antibodies are transformed from the parents to the children so here suppose for example the antibodies are transformed from the parents to uh, child through the across the across the placenta and uh, antibodies transformation from the parents to child through the colostrum colostrum so which has the high immunity uh, products or proteins high immunity products here colostrum uh, which has the high protein immunity protein contents okay so next uh, another one is artificial passive acquired immunity artificial artificial passive acquired immunity in this resistance and uh, uh, defense are transformation from the immunized persons immunized donor immunized donors to the non immunized non immunized recipient okay non immunized recipient here the the immunized antibodies are developed at the sheep and horses so from these antibodies can transform into the 
non immunized recipient so like man human being okay so it is the artificial passive acquired immunity okay right based on the immune response above could the uh, the immunity is in two types okay based on the based on the uh, what that immune response evoked based on the immune response evoked uh, the immunity is in two types okay right first one is humoral humoral immunity so and uh, cell mediated immunity cell mediated immunity let's see that first uh, cell mediated immunity cell mediated immunity so here the cell mediated immunity uh, is developed by the natural killer cells and uh, t helper cells okay so the natural killer cells and uh, t helper cells uh, which helps to the uh, development of the immune of uh, immune response of the cell mediated immunity okay so these cell mediated immunity does not involved in the production of production of antibodies production of antibodies 